Do I have what it takes To make you fall in love with me Am I the real deal Or just another one Of those who fake it I am super excited. I've just launched the boat in this stunning Tauranga Harbour and I'm going to go in search of ray riding kingfish. I've really wanted to catch these guys on fly. I've never done that on the flats yet so hopefully today is the day. It's the perfect weather conditions. If not, I've got tomorrow as well. We're going to really try hard and search these flats for these fish. If we can even just get a shot at a couple that would be fantastic. So. Let's just get straight out there. That looks beautiful. The tide's incoming and uh, the fish should be on the move. So it's just been low tide and I'm waiting for the sun to come out a bit and some water to move onto the flats. But I'm going to explore a few places and I really don't know this harbour. I don't know where to go. I don't know the places. I know I'm looking for flats uh, that I can see in and high tide's going to be in a couple of hours or more. And I'm just going to start looking for fish. At the moment it's too glary. I can't see anything. I'm going to put my sunglasses on now. And I'm going to see if I can find some markers or something. Just have a cast at. Uh, see if I can find a kingfish or a fish or something early on. Otherwise I'm just going to keep an eye out for some surface activity. And see what I can see. All exploratory and a bit of an adventure. Looks like I've just arrived in the middle of some surface busting carway, so I better get a fly out and see if I can catch one. Not big fish, but just going mad at it. I'm actually going to go for the sinking one, even though they're on the surface, they're all through the water column on the sounder. So I am going to try the sinking line. I've got the right fly on as well, I think, a little bait fish fly, Clouser. Certainly not quick like I expected it to be. Are they going to be fussy? Or do I have to go for a small fly. It's often the case if I. Oh, they're not liking my big fly. Oh no, they do. Here we go. What a fish. It's not a big one, but it is a kawaii. And we are on board. So I can keep it on. They're not big, but they are strong nonetheless. Okay, let's knit this guy. Little kawaii. But <laughs> nice to get on board with a fish. There we go, a little kawaii. Awesome, good start. Oh, they're going nuts there. I think they really like this fly though. I have to change my fly. Something a little bit, they might be a little bit more keen on. Try my different strip. A little bit slower. Oh yeah, that worked. It's a little bit slower. This one seals even smaller though. <laughs> there we go, another little carway. Let's get that one away. Okay, well, I've arrived on the flat. I'm going to start cruising up and down and uh, we'll see what we find. It's basically a matter of looking for big black stingrays and hopefully there is ray riding kingfish with them. Get a cast and hopefully hook up and catch one. <laughs> it sounds simple, but first thing you need to do is find the fish. So let's set up the electric motor, flyers and stuff is ready and um, we'll get onto it. Okay, I just saw a shape swim around. There it is still. Okay, there's fish there. I don't know what it is.
Is he gonna look? It's short. Okay. That's a bit short. It's definitely a fish of some sort. Don't know what it is. Try and get a better shot at it. The boat turned in a direction I didn't really want it to go. That is a huge perori. That is not a kawaii or a kingfish. Okay. Well, that was interesting. I didn't know they cruised the flats. Oh, I don't know if you can see it, but there goes an eagle ray. It's not the ray we're looking for. Okay. Something big just jumped there. Got chased. Let's go for a look. That has all the hallmarks of a kingfish chasing something. Yeah, I think that's a black ray. I think that's a black ray. I'm going to turn this off. Try to get a cast in. Yeah, and there's kings with it. That's calm. Okay, did they see that? They're right here. They see my flight. One's turned on it. Gonna get another shot. Let's do it on my line. They're chasing my fly. See it now, they're chasing bait. Okay, turn around time. Right, this is nerve-wracking. First row of kings, couldn't get them interested. First round, but I didn't scare them, so that's just a good start. My legs are absolutely shaking. Oh, they're tailing even. Let's sort this out. I've got to go past them and do another shot from the front. Okay. Hopefully I can get it right this time. They're moving quite fast. Oh, you can see them on the surface moving with the behind the ray. I've seen some tails come out. I've got to intercept them this time and try and get it past and get around them. Okay. I just saw them here just moments ago. Okay, they're now. Oh, busting up. Let's just get ahead of them and turn the boat. Thank you. 
too long. Line again. I'm just giving myself too much distance. Okay, it's further than you think. I really need to just keep myself in closer now. I need a decent shot. Absolutely no racking. I'm really actively feeding, but I can just get the fly in there. I'm in with a good chance. Tailing as well, which is ridiculously exciting. My heart is absolutely pounding. But not too close. Okay, turn. Turn. Turn, but it's full up. Turn around in the wrong direction. Come on. Try to get one decent shot in there. This is my shot. Chasing it, chased it, didn't like it. One more shot. No, you can't land it behind them. They don't turn around. Okay, so I've got, had that fly rejected a couple of times. Just gonna change it. Well, I was turning into a bit of a cat and mouse game. I had two rejections on that fly, so I decided I better change it. I'm kind of going to ambush them now. I know where they come, which direction they're coming to. I know where they are, so uh, let's see if I can get that to work and uh, hopefully not get rejected and get an eat. That last one he followed it quite quite a lot and then he turned away eventually, so see what happens. Okay, well I'm lining up for my ambush. Bait fish are scattering in front of them. Gonna get a decent cast here, I think. You're gonna end up a bit too close. Follow, following, following madly. Not eating though. The boat is going in the wrong direction. I didn't turn off the bloody motor. Anyway, I followed again. I messed that up if I didn't turn the motor off. That would have been perfect. They're still actively chasing. Okay. Still remember to turn the motor off. Just re refix that tangles. Oh, ah, everything that's going can go wrong is going wrong at the moment. hard on your own. Okay. Come on. You can do this, you know, you can do this.
Yes, yes. Yes, yes. Yes. No, he's not running. Come on. Run, fish. Run, fish. Run, fish. I don't want this line. Run. Oh, there you go. Yes. Yes, I'm hooked up to a kingfish. On the fly, on the flat. Off a ray. Oh my god. That is fantastic. Freaking awesome. And the ray's still there. Well, into my back, and this is a decent fish, too. He's coming towards me all the time, dragging the boat towards him. Awesome, it's a good fish. No, he's still there. See the fish. Oh. <laughs> How awesome is that? It's dragging me. This is a good fish too. Well, my day and my trip is made if I get this one in. Oh, it's already made. Just, just being hooked up is awesome. Well, the boat's going to be the last difficult part. Landing it is going to be very hard on that one. The motor's up. And the, uh, oh, this is a good fish. This is a good fish. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Can't believe it still. I chased that ray for ages. Didn't get good casting. I didn't want to go too close. I was so stressed out. Cat and mouse game. And uh, yeah, here we are. Getting it closer to the boat. Oh my goodness me. Cannot believe it. Oh. Wow. What a cool experience so far. The flat. This is where things go horribly wrong. Get the net closer. Only way I think I could possibly do it. I get it head first in the net. Yes, I tail grab it, which is another option. We're in a bit deeper water now, which is making me a little bit less worrisome. Hand would have been really handy here at the moment. There you go, I changed flies, I changed work. Sparsely tied clouser as advised by Dick Marquand. He suggested that's the way to go. Oh, the other one's following it up as well. Oh, there's one with it. There's another one with it. Oh my goodness. Very challenging. I'm not sure how exactly I'm going to do it. Currently thinking the net. I'm not sure if the net is big enough. It kind of isn't. So I'm in too deep water now to jump out. I might have to tail it. It's a 
good fish. Hit in the net and then grab the tail. Not sure. See what happens when it comes close to the boat. It's attainable. Okay. Oh, it's a nice big one. Following it. Yes, I got it in the net. I have to break that hard. <laughs> Kingfish on the flats. That is fantastically awesome. There we go. My first. Flats kingfish, woohoo! How awesome is that? First flats kingfish. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Let's get that one away. Oh, I think I finally caught my breath and uh, stopped shaking at worst. Just an incredible experience, I must say. So cool. Um, yeah, just a cat and mouse game trying to get the casting right, rejections, and yeah, finally hooking the fish.